Hello and welcome to my channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I'm going to show how you can run Antics OS in your Android using a Limbo PC emulator. So, without any wasting of time, let's get into the video. In this video, I'm going to show how you can run Antic Linux OS in your Android using Limbo PC emulator application. So, first of all, you have to download an application called Limbo PC emulator. This is the emulator for Android and the download link in the description. And you have to download the Antics. Uh, QCOW2 file it will be a prox uh, 3.76 GB the download link in the description and this is the Antics OX as you can see this is the Antics OS and Antics OS based on Linux so this is the another uh, another distribution of Linux and there are a lot of upcoming videos on my channel that I am going to show with different different Linux based uh, OS so this is the Antics OS I am going to show how you can run in your Android so this is the Limbo PC emulator I am going to open now you have to click on the none you have to click to new near now you have to create the machine i am giving this machine name antics os so as you can see i have created machine now you have to get into the user interface you have to make sure the display is on the sdl and you have to get into the board now you have to select the cpu model i am going to select a qemu32 because the cpu is perfectly work with uh, linux now I'm going to select a CPU cores. I'm going to select four RAM memory. I'm going to select uh, two GB. Uh, the RAM will depend on your smartphone specifications. I have already explained it in um, in my previous video. You can check out my previous video. There are a lot of videos on my channel that I have shown how you can run any uh, Windows in your Android, any Linux in your Android. So after selecting RAM, you have to click on the enable MTT CGC. So you have to make sure you have enabled this. So this is the new feature in the Limbo PC emulator. Now we have done all the settings in the board and CPU. Now you have to get into the disk. You have to select the disk A. You have to just click to open. Now you have to find out the, the Antics Linux uh, ISO file you have to download. So this is the, you have to select and open here. Now you have to select in the boot and you have to select the boot from hard disk. And network here. You have to select the net uh, network card. You have to just click to user uh, network because every Linux is perfectly working with internet and this OS is also perfectly work with uh, internet. So I always recommend you if you want to uh, run any uh, Linux, make sure you uh, select uh, the network card because every Linux work with internet. So I have done all the settings in the Limbo as you can see and there is no uh, high priority option in the new Limbo PC emulator as you can see they removed the high priority uh, check button in the advanced so, it, so this is the new Limbo so I have done all the settings now I am going to turn on the screen rotation and turn the Android phone for the button understanding see, just now I have turned the Android phone I am going to click to play button and make sure you have connected with the internet it's maybe your mobile data or Wi-Fi so as you can see I am going to just click to play button so as you can see after it will saying booting from hard disk so as you can see in the screen antics linux has been started now i'm going to just click to enter after enter uh, they starting to, they started showing some scripts and commands so it will going to take some time so i'm going to just fast forward this video and come back after it's fully loaded So as you can see in the screen the finally Antics Linux OS has been successfully booted in Android and as you can see this is the desktop it's been only taken about uh, 3 to 4 minutes to fully load so as you can see this is the fastest uh, Linux uh, on my channel I am going to show so as you can see this is uh, this is the desktop it will look like this and there are a lot of options so I am going to show you 
uh, it is in the different language as you can see but you can change the language in the settings you can do it by yourself i'm going to show some basic features of this linux and this is the fastest linux i've ever seen so i'm going to first of all i'm going to open uh, the internet and there are a lot of preloaded softwares uh, a lot of preloaded uh, browsers in it so just now i've opened a browser so as you can see this is the dildo browser open here So I am going to search in this browser. So as you can see in the screen, this is the browser and this is the internet perfectly works. Now I have searched google.com in the search uh, in the search bar and as you can see the google.com appear here. So let me again I am going to search anything in the google. Uh, with let test uh, the google is working or not so as you can see this is the google perfectly working in android so the internet's perfectly work in this linux so this is the antics linux and there are a lot of preloaded software so let me just show you so the status bar is uh, given same like as a windows so this is the applications and this is the antex linux preloaded uh, there are a lot of accessories calculator uh, notepad some linux softwares paint and this is the browser or uh, multimedia video player everything so as you can see there are a lot of preloaded softwares in this so I am going to the main important software of the Linux is the terminal that mean the terminal is the most important software in the Linux uh, you can do a lot of hacking and a lot of things uh, while using with the terminal in the Linux so as you can see there are a lot of uh, preloaded softwares in this uh, but it is in the different language you can change the language in the settings you can if you want to change you can you have to just to search on the internet how to change language in the index they will uh, show you so as you can see this is the file manager uh, of this antics linux so this is the fastest linux i have uh, ever seen uh, every software is perfectly opening within a second it doesn't take a lot of time to open uh, any software as you can see in the screen and at this side as you can see in the desktop it will showing all the uh, details of the cpu hardware uh, it will sing the cpu frequency the ram used the ram is free everything it will showing we have selected 2 gb ram and it will using only 90 mb ram so means uh, approx uh, 1900 mb ram is left so you can open a lot of softwares at a time and do a lot of multitasking in this antics uh, uh, linux ox so as you can see this is the uh, antis linux os perfectly working in android so this is the terminal software i am going to open it so as you can see in the screen so this is the terminal software uh, i am going to just type something in the so this is the terminal uh, so perfectly working So you can type some commands and do a lot of uh, uh, things with this terminal as you can see the terminal is also perfectly working so as you can see this is the uh, antics linux os perfectly working in android with using limbo pc emulator so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have any question or problem let me know in the comments thank you